In this video, we'll be using the fundamental counting principle to solve problems. The fundamental counting principle says if one event has m outcomes and another event has n outcomes, then there are m times n possible outcomes for the two events together. Our first problem, how many ways can the numbers 3, 5, 7, and 8 be arranged if no repetition is permitted? Right, now we're going to be arranging all four numbers. So I'm going to have four spaces that I can fill with numbers. And the only requirement on this problem is that we have no repetition. So I, I can fill in this first spot. I have four choices of numbers. I can put either a 3, a 5, a 7, or an 8 in there. So I have four ways that I can fill in this spot. And then because of the fundamental counting principle, we know that we multiply that by the number of ways that I can fill in this spot. Now I've already used up one of these four numbers, so now I only have three numbers left to choose from for this spot, and then multiply that by, and then now I've used up two numbers, so I only have two numbers left for this spot, and then for this spot there's only one number left, so when I multiply these, I get 24 ways. Now for our next problem, we want to know how many ways can the numbers 3, 5, 7, and 8 be arranged if repetition is permitted. So this time, I'm going to put numbers in these spots but I'm allowed to repeat. So I have four ways that I can fill this first spot. And then since I'm allowed to repeat the numbers, I have four again for this spot. And likewise here and here. So this, by the fundamental counting principle, we multiply those number of ways together. This is 4 to the 4th power, which is 256. Our next problem, how many four-letter signs can be made from the letters in the word equal if no repetition is permitted? So we have four letter signs, so we're only going to be allowed to use four letters. But I'm choosing from one, two, three, four, five letters in the word equal. So to put in my first letter, I have five letters to choose from. And then since I'm not allowed to repeat letters, for my next spot, I only have four letters to choose from. And then for my next one, only three. And then for my next one, two. This product is 20 times 6, 120. And then for my last problem, how many four-letter signs can be made from the letters in the word equal if repetition is permitted? So again, I'm only doing four letters, and I have five letters to choose from. So I have five here, and since I'm allowed to repeat letters, I again have five for this spot, five for this spot, and five for this spot. So the total here is five to the fourth power, or 625.